welcome back to my channel it's your girl yanni and today we're gonna be doing sort of like a hair first impressions basically sort of kind of i'm actually gonna be doing or trying attempting to do i'm in my bathroom just in case you didn't see i'm gonna attempt to do a braided ponytail so last year you guys know that i had my hair braided down when i lived in west palm beach but i had some extra hair braiding hair that i bought down south this is 54 inch um length hair it's fine premium hair it's by samra easy yaki braid braiding hair so this is the brown, dark brown ombre to silver I have a lot of silver coming out of my hair um so i'm gonna attempt to do a braided pony so if you guys are interested in going along with me on this journey then go ahead and grab a snack grab a bottle of water because you know i'm still trying to get healthy up in this joint and keep on watching okay so i washed my hair i put some leave-in on it and then i blow dried my hair with my revlon um styler and then sorry then i am gonna get ready to pull it back into a pony so i got two hair ties one for the braided hair one for my hair then i also got my edger with my um real tap the rat tail comb on the end or rat tail um on the end then for gel i've got this huge ass eco style professional styling gel this has black castor oil and flaxseed this is my favorite um i also have this i was put on by a friend of mine this is called true edge plus controller um it's extreme hold this is in the scent strawberry and this has black castor oil and hemp seed oil and it lasts up to 24 hours so i'm excited about that i've got my got to be glued hairspray because i'm gonna need all these little hairs on the end over here to stay down and then of course i got my brush to pull it back in a ponytail and then my smoothing brush so that's everything that I have. I've watched a ton of videos, of course, and my hair that you saw earlier. So let's get on with this because I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this. So I have called in my assistant. <laughs> She's going to help me with my hair. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to start to slick it back into the pony. I have a lot of short hairs in the back. So it's going to take a lot, a lot of this and a lot a lot of this so we're gonna start that she is putting the pony the hair together so the girls that i've seen they've put it like oh a lot they put it around the your hair. hairline because you have this to get is... everything we want this to be nice and sleek. And I always put it in the back as well. This is like how I regularly do my ponies. The only thing is that we're going to be adding the gots to be glue. Because this is my first time using that product. <laughs> so we're going to see. That's my first impressions. Because <laughs> honestly. And then I've seen people like put the hair put the hair in half and kind of like put also hair. put gel in the middle so i'm going to do that too because i have Let's thicker hair on the top because my hair is growing back you have a brush with you right i do okay, good. i have three two brushes on my coat i think i have enough product <sighs> well i should say when you think you have enough product put more yes <laughs> <laughs> So the most that I'm gonna need it is probably in the very back. Okay, yes. I'm gonna put more. And for those pieces right now. Jeez. I have like not so <laughs> thick hair. Call in an assistant and she's worried about her own hair. My hair looks fine. By the way guys, this is not my hair. Go to I need hair. I get some hair. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's my favorite hair store for my ponytails. Yes. But we're trying a, a different, like. A different method. Yeah. Cause like I want super long. Super, 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 super,
super long braided pony. I didn't take out, maybe I should take a little baby hair out. Just to, <laughs> just to try Just to try it. Just to try it. Just try it. I'm just gonna take right here. Sneak it back in. Look at these little baby hairs. I don't hurt you, but I have brushed a little hard just to get everything. Like... I am not tender headed. So oh, you're okay. Sorry. Just maybe here is there. Here. You said like right here, right? Oh, I like this little comb thing. Yeah. The comb thing is, I like that. Okay. And then oh, I can take some baby hairs over there. So right here. Does that look even? No. Okay. One second. Uh -huh. I'm just trying to make sure that the baby hairs match. Oh, I can tell you that I'm probably going to have all these breakouts. Baby hairs work. I feel like these are a little longer. Oh, I think it's a little extra. Whatever hair falls out too. I could just spray it back with the cuts. You can sneak it back with the cuts to me because it'll look it better. Because eco styling gel, it works for it. I use it more for the benefits of the yes. nourishment. Because this has black seed oil and castor oil in this particular one that I use. Okay. So, you said right here. Right? Mm -hmm. See if that one works. If not, we can always get a thicker one because a like thicker my... one would also, would help, but a thin one. Would be because we're putting the it. other one, so. I mean, you want it to be thick enough to wear the elastic band with the, like, with the. Like it's not smooth. the ponytail going I slicked it nice and sleek and because I have gel in the back my little hairs are like coming down so we're gonna go ahead and blow dry Hold on. I should use the edge control that's okay I'm just gonna so these can stay you can down put the edge control with the gel I know because it's gel on gel just a stronger gel a thicker gel I know but I want to just put it so that it doesn't fly into the hair all right, here we go. No drag. No up. Let me know, because I can feel that it's starting to get dry, but let me know if you feel like a wet feeling on, your, on the back of your head, mm -hmm. so I know that it's still kind of wet. Okay. First time using that product too. So it's my first time using this. First time using that edge control. First time with this. I like this part. This part is a little flimsy. I like my brush to be a little bit more stiff. That's all right. I know. I took a lot. Oh, so thick. It's bigger than mine. 
Oh, that literally goes a long way, she says. I think you might have to take it to her. So I saw this thing that they use this uh, wax, a hair wax that comes like in a bon uh, like a and deodorant, like a deodorant stick. Yep. So I was like, hmm, I'm gonna have to try to see if they have that in the beauty supply. That's what they, that's how they keep their little frizzies. And they said it's basically like beeswax because beeswax yeah. is natural and it's good. You can, you can also use it for your wigs if whenever your wigs are like frizzy. So excited right now because my hair has never been like this sleek back. It always ends up falling and I put like 8,000 clips in the back. Close your eyes. If I end up liking that product, then this will be it for me. <laughs> yeah. And it dries super fast. So you can like, spread, spread. One, two, three. Super interesting. Now we're gonna put the scarf on. We don't have a scarf, like she said, but we have a bandana, which can semi work. So, all right. Now for the fun part, because the hardest part is to sleek everything down. So now. It's to attach the hair. At the end, so you want to take some hair out. I wrap it around my neck because I didn't know what else to do with it. So we're taking one piece and we're wrapping it around the hair ties so that you can not see the hair ties. This might be a fail. A fail? It might be a fail. Don't say that. But it's my first time. Can't expect it to come out perfect. Now we're going to separate into three. Okay, so we are starting the braid and we're gonna go from there. Rough start, absolutely 100%. Yes. I think if my hair was longer, we wouldn't have so much trouble, but my hair is short, so we're gonna work with it. Yes. Do you know how to do the feed in? Okay, so you're gonna need me to pass you pieces. Hold the fade in there. Okay. Wait, I don't think right now you should do that. Why? Because it's still the same length. It's okay. I think you should braid more. Because I'm going to be adding throughout. So she, when she braids, she usually goes like two braids and then she adds. Or like two knots and then adds. I would do, do an extra I did, one. I just did three knots. Miss Perella. I'm not a pro, I've just watched so many of them. I need help.
probably we unanimous. Just, <laughs> like we just finished the braid and we are dipping the hair in hot water. Super hot water. You see the steam coming out of it. And we do have to fix up top and I'm sure we have to fix, fix some edges in the back, my hair. But first try, I still have to do my edges here, which I should have did earlier because I see all the girls doing it in the videos and then holding it down, but that's all right. I don't know how long we're supposed to leave this. To Never it says it. For... I think the best, like three minutes. Okay. So should I hold it? Because um, you have to pass I'm the fine. towel over it, right? Yes. Are you fine holding it for like yeah. another two minutes or so? Because yeah. right now it's just 57 seconds. <laughs> so yeah, so we're going to dip it and then we're going to pull it out. And then dry with the towel. And then work on the edges. I mean, this is dry. Okay, so we've dried the hair. I wrapped the end um, with some edge control around my little comb. So I could just curl the bottom. And then... I think I'm just going to leave the baby hairs for the morning because it's already 8.30 at night. I want to take my contacts off. So I will be back in the morning to finish this up Toodles. with no assistant because she'll be in school. Oh, no. Tomorrow's spring Tomorrow's break, so she'll be here. But she'll be, be sleeping. Up, she'll be up early in the morning. Oh, <laughs> so good night. Have a good day. It was nice talking to you guys. Peace out. <laughs> See you guys in the morning. Good morning, y'all. So I am getting myself ready. And my son is watching YouTube, so you might hear him in the background. But we are going to get ready to take this out, do the baby hairs, and slick the back. Because I got to get ready for school, and I want to do some makeup. Very light makeup. So let's see. Doesn't look too bad. Let's see the back, which is the most important part of the front. So, not too, too bad. Let's see. I'm going to press a little back. Not too, too bad. The braid itself is what I was really, 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 really worried about. She, she long. She long. And definitely needed to, need to clean her up. So, take some scissors. I'm just going to clean up all these baby hairs. Kind of where you see the long ones popping out. Basically, go up and down the braid. Because I love Rapunzel. Rapunzel, then I got a scar on her. She Okay, I think it stayed. That's very good. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and fix this piece right here because this was already falling out. So my daughter told me to use some has to be because she's sleeping right now she ain't even gonna get up
I feel like because my hairs are so short in the back, they, with the braid rubbing against the hair in the back, they gotta come out. I'm just gonna go blow dry that piece and I'll be right back. All right, I'm gonna throw on some makeup because I have to before I do my little edges. I'm gonna try, attempt to do edges. I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back. I put some of my makeup on. I still have to put lips. I still have to do my lashes, brows, but this is how I did my edges. This is the first time I do edges. They're all right. This side came out a little whack. This side I like a little better. It is whatever it is. Um, this hair just doesn't know what it wants to do with itself. I keep trying to lay it and she like no i want to go this way and yeah like trying my best to like do little c swoops but the little c swoop is not working for me for whatever reason on this side i put some guts to be glue i put some of the edge the true edge control it doesn't seem to be working well I, I think it's just me and I know that I'm supposed to I'm just gonna put a little bit more just kind of keep it going because I know for a fact because it's raining over here that it's gonna they're gonna pop right back up so while I finished up the rest of my hair, I'm gonna go ahead, I mean, the rest of my makeup, I'm gonna take this, and I'm just gonna tie this. And hope to God that it stays. Okay. I'm gonna do my brows and I'm gonna throw on some highlighter and some lips and lashes. All right, I'm ready for school. I'm just waiting for my face to dry a little bit, my lips to dry. For lips, I used the NYX Shine Loud Lip Pigment in Go Getter. Waiting for that to dry down so I can put the gloss part on it. And then that's it. I hate that I have two different eye shapes because I feel like I don't put my lashes on right and it sucks, but they are on right. And then I'm just gonna kind of leave this on until I get to school, but this is the braid. And what I have come to terms with is that because my hair is so, so short in the back still, because my hair is very short, especially on the sides here, I did put a lot of edge control and I did put a lot of the gossipy glue. Um, right now my hair is super crunchy for me, um, but it's fine. I wanted this style and then of course like i said i'm going to keep this on to lay the edges but i found that because my hair is still a little too short it didn't lay as sleek as i want it because obviously there's no tension to hold the hair so they're kind of just going with the flow um so i know i'm going to try this style again when my hair is longer on this side because i have it um short on this side and then we'll see from there but i know that i can do it i know that it's super easy I love braids and that completes this video if you guys enjoyed watching me create this braided ponytail like extra long ankle braided ponytail then please like this video of course and subscribe to my channel hit the notification bell down below so you can get notified every time I upload videos which is randomly right now and yeah I hope you guys enjoyed I want to try to do different content on my channel because it makes me come out of my comfort zone I love hair design so this is right up my alley and yeah, I hope you guys enjoy again. I gotta get ready to drop my baby at school. So thank you so much for all the love and support. And I will see all you beauties in my next video. Bye.